Right, so when you've got your RGB stuff all set up under uh, temperature. So, first off, Corsair IQ now can link up with ASUS Strix motherboards. And ASUS Strix motherboards can obviously link up with ASUS Strix graphics cards. So I've got all of those things. Um, so now you can go into IQ and you can do this lightning link malarkey which will link it all together. Choose temperature, choose Intel Core i7 10700K, so I've chose the CPU. Um, that's the package, so that's like the inside, not, not, not the outside, what the water's running at in the, uh, in the Corsair. 40 is about as, as cool as it gets. Um, 80 is about as hot as it gets. It can go hotter if I really hammer it. 50's in between, so I've gone blue, 40 yellow for 50, red for 80 degrees C. Now, we look here at the moment, we are, this is the problem with this uh, camera in the dark, it's not great, we are blue, we are bluey purple. Oh, now you see it's just gone off a little bit, it's gone, it's gone white, now it's gone back down to blue. CPU in a bit of background activity. HW info. So we got all of our sensors that we need in HW info. Like to have all the CPU package temps, core temps listed out, um, the liquid temperature of the AIO cooler, the core usage of the CPU, and for good measure, the pump speed of the AIO. Uh, the three fans that are on the radiator for the AIO, their fan speeds, and then the GPU temperature and the GPU fan speed. So, all set up there, monitoring away nicely, and city bench ready to run. We are blue and going to click that run button right there on Cinebench and see what happens. My betting is it goes red. There we go. Run. Performing render test preparing project. Oh, yellow. Orangey yellow. Orangey. There we go. So like a dark orange. While well, Cinebench is doing its thing. And as you can see, the CPU package is at 74, 75 degrees C. So not quite 80. That's not quite red. It's like a dark orange. So that is working perfectly. Cores are all 74, 75. You can see the usage gone up to 100% on each core. Uh, I haven't got my pump doing anything. My AIO, AIO is just set to balanced. Um, it, will, it will ramp up if it needs to itself. It's already ramped up a little bit on the fans as you can see. To cater for that. The GPU is not doing sod all. This is all CPU. And that's finished. With a bench of what did we get? Five oh four four. Is that one of the better ones? Oh, that is one of the better ones. In fact, that's a really good one. Five oh four four is better than the last best bench I got. So, turns out if you get your RGB synced, you can get better performance at your PC. Jokes. So that's back to blue now because it's not doing anything. Beautiful, beautiful.